Hello everyone, what is going on? I'm the Laggy Lemon, and I'm bringing you a video about Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now, I would have gotten this video out a lot earlier, but I've had family in town and have not had a lot of time to do it. Now, I will put the screenshot up on the video right now, but basically this is a screenshot from Amazon.com, and they're giving out a lot of secret information about the game, and I'm basically going to read it right now. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, developed by Sledgehammer Games, co-developers of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, harnesses the first three-year all-next-gen development cycle in franchise history. So like I said in my last video, is that this now it takes three years to make a Call of Duty instead of two. So now every Call of Duty should be a lot better because they got a whole nother year to process or make the game. The next part is Call of Duty Advanced Warfare envisions the powerful battlegrounds of the future where both technology and tactic have evolved to usher in a new era of combat for the franchise. So it's pretty obvious in that sentence. The game's going to be in the future. Delivering a stunning performance, Academy Award winning actor Kevin Spacey stars as Jonathan Irons, one of the most powerful men in the world shaping this chilling vision of the future of war. So they got a uh, Academy winning actor and he's basically the man who you saw in the trailer. The next part says Call of Duty Advanced Warfare takes place in the plausible future in which technological progress and today's military practices have converged with powerful consequences. In this carefully researched and crafted vision of the future, private military corporations, PMCs. So now we know for sure, it's we are going to be in a private military. PMCs have become the dominant armed force for countless nations outsourcing their military needs, redrawing borders, and rewriting the rules of war. And Jonathan Irons, the founder and president of the world's largest PMC, Atlas Corporation, is at the center of it all. So now it's pretty much confirmed. We are going to be fighting in the future, in a private military, and hopefully Jonathan Irons doesn't turn on you like General Shepard did. Ouch. That one hurt me when I saw when the end of that game came... That, I was so confused. The next part says, Powerful exo exoskeletons evolve every aspect of a soldier's battle readiness, enabling combatants to deploy with an advanced lethality and eliminating the need for specialization. So, it's turning to be a lot like Halo and a lot like Titanfall. The introduction of this gameplay mechanic delivers enhanced player movement and vertically through boosts, jumps, and grappling, convert cloaking abilities and biomechanics that provide on paralleled strength, awareness, endurance, and speed. Now, this is really turning to sound like Titanfall and Halo. With the advent of the exoskeleton and newly advanced armor and weaponry, every soldier commands tactical freedom in any terrain unlike ever before, fundamentally changing the way gamers play Call of Duty across all modes. Now, I know a lot of people have been argumenting in the comments, or on Twitter, or on any place, saying you can't compare these games to Titanfall and Halo. They're completely different games, but I don't know. It, it's a lot futuristic, and I believe Titanfall got their game out before Call of Duty. And the last part says, Harnessing the power of the next-gen platforms, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare brings players into the battlegrounds of the future by boasting a new high-tech advanced arsenal and ability set aiming players 
with all new equipment, technology, perks, and vehicles like hover bikes and highly specialized drones. This is turning out to be a pretty exciting and fun sounding Call of Duty. Players can also choose between standard ammunition and an all new class of directed energy weaponry that enables totally new gameplay dynamics. And with exoskeletons delivering a massive force, multiplier, and unprecedented tactical freedom, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare evolves every firefight. Now that was a big descriptive, informative article on Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, and it included most of the things the trailer just left out. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I might be doing more of these Call of Duty secretly linked information, but I think I'll stick to commentaries and funny moments, but make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, and comment down in the comment section if you'd like to see more and what you'd like to see on my channel. I'm always trying to get my channel better for you guys and for me. So I hope you guys have an awesome day. I'll see you guys in the next video.